Okay, hi, Valder. Good morning, Kim Whitley. Thank you for joining us again in Dallas, Texas. Hey, Dallas! Well, you're so popular here, I had to talk to you. But you and your show, your docu-series, as they call it, on OWN, Raising Whitley, I am totally enjoying you. Oh, well, thank you so much. I'm so glad that you're tuning in to the second season. Um, you know, it's, it's a wonderful ride. I've really enjoyed it. I know. You never know what God has laid out for you. Look, at you've gone from doing stand-up, and you're still doing stand-up comedy for adults, and now you're trying to teach your baby how to be potty trained. That's pretty <laughs> a big accomplishment, Kim. <laughs> well, thank you so much. <laughs> and it does change my stand-up. It definitely has. I, you got great material, because I, I hear you have man space drama on, on this season. Tell me about that. Well, you know, the second season, the first season, let's say, first of all, it was only 30 minutes. The second season is an hour long, so now it's more like a dramedy. Um, Rodney, the baby daddy, uh, has moved in, so that is going to uh, cause some, you know, little drama there. And um, well, the, this the second season, we also get to look deeper into the lives of the villagers. Well, that's really good. Also, too, your life is going a little bit deeper. I think you're you're either dating or or into a romance. Tell me which one. What? what? You, uh, you got to watch the show. <laughs> I can't just tell you. I can't just spill the beans. Well, we're so excited for you. <laughs> you got to watch the show and see about a budding romance or if I'm dating or, you know. I know. See, I've been watching the show. That's why I know all of this. You do. I was like, oh, you've done your homework. That's great. <laughs> You're so easy to follow, you know. You're one of those, oh, what time is it? I got to watch Kim Whitley and oh, Raising Whitley. Oh, I appreciate it. I do hear a lot of people like, oh, I got to watch it. And that's what I love about the show is that it has something for everyone. Uh, the whole family can watch it, so that's why I love it. It is. Kim, are you having the best of life at this point in time, or is this really hard? Tell me which one. Oh, the best of life. Uh, I've always uh, had a good life. I uh, always enjoyed it. Great parents. I uh, grew up in uh, Cleveland, Ohio and lived around the world. I mean, I, I can't even, I couldn't, if I wanted to say, oh, I want to pick someone else's life. I, I've had, I, I've enjoyed it. And, and being on um, Oprah Winfrey Network, what a great home for my show. So, I mean, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty happy right now doing a lot of other projects. Uh, got a wonderful son and uh, great friends. What other projects can we look forward to you doing? Because I don't know how you have time, but what other <laughs> projects can we look forward to? Well, um, I have uh, a new show on ABC Family called uh, Young and the Hungry, and I have, uh, I'm have i a reoccurring on Baby Daddy on there. And, uh, of course, my cartoon, Black Dynamite, is coming back for the second season. And I have a movie coming up with Marlon Wayans called Haunted House 2 in March. That's a lot. Let me ask you what every, uh, not every, but many of the listeners always ask me, how do you find balance when you have a child, but you still have a life and a career and, a, and you have to support your life and career? How do you find balance? Well, one is I built a village. And a lot of us don't ask for help. And uh, we try to do it ourselves. And that's when we cannot give back to our children because we're exhausted. And that's how I had to find balance. And um, uh, if I could encourage um, your, your followers to watch the show and see that you can go through life and you can laugh and you can be upset. But if you get a core of friends and family and say, hey, you know what, can you help me with this? Or, or can you take my kids uh, for an hour or two? I just want to read a book. It, it doesn't matter what you have to do. It's not like you, if you have to go to work. You know, I just need a minute so that when the children come back in your life, that you're happy and, and you're, you're warm to them because that's what makes uh, children flourish. And well, uh, I, I guess that's, that's how I do it. That's how I find balance. Well, and you're doing it lot. so well, and I think your child is going to be so excited when he looks back at this portion of his life because you're one of those people that can look back and not be embarrassed or ashamed and say, yeah, that's what I did. That's what I did. That's what having a baby, you, you have to start making different choices. Uh, especially well, with your projects. And so what night do you want us to tune in on? Saturday nights, every Saturday night on OWN at 9 o'clock uh, on, of course, Oprah Winfrey Network. Watch Raisin Whitley and 8 o'clock uh, Central. You make my heart sing, Kim Whitley. Oh, thank you so oh, much for that. being the person that you are. Thank you. And thank you. God bless you.
You make my heart sing. That's so cute.